To really make significant progress in the scientific question, you have to let people exercise their creativity. Fairward started to say, hey, how do I do innovation in AI research? Powered by people's brain rather than by process or structure. And it's not something that a typical industrial company can do. In exploratory research, there's a need to have freedom to deviate from the planned path. It's a core value of FAIR that researchers have a lot of freedom in choosing their research projects. One of the really nice things about FAIR is that there's very little bureaucracy. It's a very flat organization and they put a lot of trust in the researchers to make the right choices. Sometimes you have a lot of ideas and you just want time to explore them. I find that here at FAIR, really management is a very supportive role. The research is really bottom up, so it comes from the ideas of researchers and engineers. You're really unrestricted. You know, you get to make your own story for what your impact is going to be, right? And, and over time, that story can even change. You can move around between projects and even initiate new projects. It makes it easier to take risks. You don't want that to be conservative because this is not what we're here for. We're here to think beyond what's possible. For me, that was a really compelling aspect of FAIR. The freedom to pursue the kind of research that interests me most and I think is most important. To work with people that are excited about the same sort of things that I'm excited about. A great environment for research is one which gets the best people and then lets them free. I think this is the secret of all the great research labs of the past. And that freedom is essential because you do your best creative work when you're most passionate about it. You're here because you're one of the best in the world. We have a strong belief that you can make a difference. Show it.